right and we're back so let's come back and fix this so what these clean urls actually mean for us is that wherever we put our id should always be in that order so always the first item is the page name right the second item should be maybe the username uh, or user id and then the third one is uh, another parameter that we can actually add so this order must be maintained otherwise things will break apart or if we know that we are always using the the id like this uh, as as um, if the id will always be a number we could check for if it's a number we check this one if it's a, a number if it's not a number then we get the second item if it exists so we can put those things just to be safe if you want to do it that way but i would rather you just maintain the correct order of things that way you don't have to worry about that kind of thing so in order to follow that order here we'll come back to where we did put these links which is right here and then we will swap the about section let's let's get that slash there and the about and put it right at the end so I will move this guy to there. Same thing here. Same thing there. And same thing there. Okay, so we should always remember this, even the settings, uh, this has to be at the end. Now this one is a bit tricky. Okay, should be here. So I will put it right there, like so. Okay, good. So now let me refresh my page, go back to this user. So I am on this user's uh, page now. And now if I click on about, you will see that I'm still on this user's page, regardless whether this has shown or not, but I'm still, at least I'm still on this user's page. Uh, same thing here, following and photos. So that's one step further. Now, the only thing we need to do is to tell it what to get here so and this will be in location number two because two is the one that contains the the different section here so url two so where are you so we can remove that because we now know the number that we're looking for okay so section is equal to uh -huh. So right here, what we want is to change this. So let's change that to URL2. So if it is set, then uh, that item is right here. Bam. So now sec section is equal to default and so on. So if it's none of these, then uh, you need to just maintain the original. So let's uh, refresh here. And as you can see, we are back to following uh followers about section photos oh we went too far there okay so that's the timeline and this one is should be the about section okay uh followers following photos okay so things uh, are looking good the only thing is uh, photos are not being seen here because, of course, we haven't put the correct linking system. So let's come to the profile content photos right there. So in here, all we have to look for are the sources and the hrefs. So let's start with the hrefs. We have an href right there. What do I get when I paste? No. So let's put root. Sorry there. Actually, this is already inside an echo statement, so we can simply uh, move out of it, put root, and then get back inside. So like this. So let's see. Uh -huh. And we also have a source here, so we need our source to have root as well. Like that. Okay, I think uh, that should actually do it. So let's refresh. 
And as you can see, we have the images and the problem is the links to the images have not been adjusted. So let's uh, figure that out as well. Oh, which is this one right here. So I will change this as usual from uh, that to just a slash like so. So it's single post and then the post ID. So let's refresh and let's see. There we go. So we have single post there. So things are looking good. So what else do we change here before we leave? And that is the follow button. So the follow button here uh, goes to like.php and we must edit that as well. So let me go to the follow here inside profile.php. I will search for follow. Let's see where we find it. Oh, I saw something there. Let me go back. Oh, I went too far. Okay, so there we go. Header location. Please look for the header locations as well and change them. So here, we'll have to move this guy out of here. Let's put root and then profile like so. So all the header location should be like that. Okay, so I think, uh, oh, I'm looking for the follow button here. Where is the follow button? Uh oh, what's happening? Let's inspect the element here. Actually, this shouldn't be difficult to find. This is profile.php, so it must be somewhere close to the end. Not the JavaScript, but uh, right here. Okay, so it seems uh, like, oh, this is the one right here. So my bad here, I put PHP there, so it, there shouldn't be a PHP there. It should just be like user and so on. Okay, so uh, pretty good so far. If I hover on this one, yes, I get my correct kind of data. Okay, so I think here we are, we are doing really well. The like button already works, I think. Yep, that one already works. Very good. Okay, so what we're remaining with now is to do the single uh, the single post. So let's go to the single post here. Let me get one with an image, click comment, and there's single post, and it seems to actually work, doesn't it? Seems to be working. So let's uh, confirm this in single post. Why is it working? single post there we go okay that's because we actually did something already there get profile ah so we actually did only that um, header location here we have to remove this and put that like so okay so single posts, what else do we need here? Let's find all the hrefs here. Mm -hmm. There we go. So we have a few loose ends here. So right there, we add our root. So just keep looking for all the links here that need to be changed and then you just change them. So ID, bam like that good and we are good to go let me copy this for further use okay so the pagination we're going to deal with that uh, okay so i think uh, we're actually good to go so as we find uh, more things and anyway, the includes can be left like this as we find more issues okay those are fine we will adjust them as we go because there's so much to change at once. Let me refresh the page. Let me like this. So the like doesn't work here. 
uh, pretty understandable because this is not the JavaScript version. This is the normal PHP version. And I bet the edit will not take us to the edit section as well. Uh, same thing with the delete, it will not do that. Okay, so in the next video, we'll fix uh, items on this single page until they work with our, let me check that out, same thing here. Okay, so I'll see you in the next video.